under the auspices of La Mama and Theater Communications Group. Uh, she is the recipient of this year's uh, extraordinary potential uh, for the Fox Fellowship for given to actors. There are no other grants given to actors except the Fox Fellowship, and this is our recipient for uh, extraordinary potential. Please welcome Ms. Heather Matia. Lemonade. TV. I'm a hooker, a hustler, a coke dealer too, a junkie, a mistress, a dominatrix just for you. I'm a psychopathic killer. Really? Am I? No. <laughs> I'm not. I just play one on TV. I'm arrested by pigs, I'm ripped from brothels, I'm whipped, I'm wrapped up in chains, I'm spanked, I'm fucked, I've sucked fat cocks. Does anyone make love anymore? Silver Helen. Well, you have to polish the sugar bowl and the coffee creamer, too. Everyone's gonna come. The whole Presbyterian church is coming over. The Red Hat Club, the, 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 the birthday club, and my whole water class is coming on Helen. Mom, but I really, I don't want an engagement party. I mean, I'm just like, you know, I'm just like not sure. Helen, you know this could be my last. Christmas. Heather, I've got something for you. Wrapped up in plastic like an alcohol cup, cocaine snowflakes or a cigarette puff, or perhaps your cock did you get your dick wet if you didn't take advantage of little Goldilocks. Bring, 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 bring. Hello. Hey, yeah, I'm great. 
good. Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> well, that's perfect for me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Send me the sides. Well, do you think that we could talk sometime? I mean, you know, I mean, I'm doing this show downtown. Yeah, I mean, I got like a half a page in the new... Well, hello? Uh, hello? Well, I, I know you're busy, yeah, but, uh, hello? Uh. Scene. Blousy. Caucasian, prostitute, 30s, getting a tad old, redhead, partial nudity. Some vestiges of human life left. Here's the setup. 1970s, New York City, Harlem. Scantily clad hookers lie in the hallway, in the house, in the, every room, and the brothel is occupied. Raucous laughter is heard throughout the rooms. The cops are standing by, just waiting to bust in on the girls. Ford Hooker, number one! Look, pal, I'm driving this train. John. Oh, oh shit! Cops, break it up! Ford Hooker, number one! Get your fucking hands off me, you fucking pigs! When you do a scene like that, you have to make sure that you flip your hair, otherwise that you don't get in the shot, or they edit you out of things like that. Got it? Lemonade. 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 Give her a pill. Give her a drink. Give her some coke. Eventually she'll sink. How did it happen to a little girl from the South? She had a good mommy, and a good daddy, and a really nice house. Bang. Hello? Hey, Mom. Yeah, hey, how are you feeling? Well, you know, Helen, nothing good ever happens after midnight. Well, how about two or three or four? Don't you sass me, Helen. Do you have a cold, honey? You sound awful tired. What time did you get home last night? I've been trying to call you. I had a horrible day at dialysis. You know, I am very sick. They just keep trying to stick me and they just can't find it. Hella, I've just been so... Mom, I'm really sorry. I just, I just got caught up. I didn't mean to. I... What? I told you not to Google me, Mom. Well, well, it's fake. Well, your friends shouldn't Google me either. You should just really learn to text. Honey, I don't feel good right now. I think I should just lie down. I'll just talk to you later. Mom, I'm really sorry it took so long. I'm just happy to know that you're not lying in a ditch somewhere. I am very weak, Heather Lynn. She ran, she ran, she ran into the night. She was real scared, but she would never show it. She would always fight. She fought and she fought from 2nd Street, Rivington, Avenue A, onward to Chelsea, then Avenue C, a brief stint in Hoboken with a Cuban Italian coke dealer that broke her whole face, then a soap opera TV star that OD'd with a tranny in the LES. Well, she was in Paris, dancing the dance. Where did she go? The little girl in the trenches of the LES. Amy. Down to the river and out to the sea. I'm not a hooker. I just I just play one on TV. Bring, bring. Hello. Hey, yeah. How are you? Oh, wow, yeah, I mean, I'll have to think about that. <laughs> really? I have two scenes? I mean, I have a first name and a last name? <laughs> and I have lines? Oh, yeah, I know, she's, she was amazing. I don't know, it's, it's, it's a lot. Oh, you can't see my whole face. I don't know, I mean... I mean, I could use the money. 
I mean, I want a close set. And, and can I get points? Okay. I'll do it. Just send me this. Well, I guess, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Out of work actress, 20s. Well, it was a long time ago. She used to be pretty, but she was abused. Single mother, works at an after hours gambling joint. Desperate, she turns tricks on the sides to make ends meet, to support a feverish coke habit. Here's the setup Franny, gazillionaire famous actress, walks down into the basement of a dive bar, the Blue Turtle. She hears a rhythmic scraping noise. Looking, she is transfixed on a man sitting on a tattered sofa. His head is resting against a wall illuminated with a small pink light. On the floor we see Angela Sands, 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 kneeling between his legs. Her hair is spread across his lap. She moves her head back and forth with a dipping motion. She takes the man's cock into her mouth. Her sucking is loud. Her long blue nails grip his thighs. Franny sees, gazillionaire actress, and the man knows, giving her a good look at his cock coming out of Angela Sand, 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 Sand's mouth. Franny rises and stands to the door. As if to be sacrificed, the man moans, and so does Angela, letting him know she is tired. He puts his hands on top of her bobbing head, gripping her hair and letting her know that he is about to come. Franny. Man. Oh, oh, oh. too late, Helen. I mean, I went back to school when you were just a little girl and I graduated with honors. I mean, you tested highest in your class in the fifth grade. I mean, you were so good in math. You know, when I had my own company before I got my accent, you know, I'm on dialysis and these pills are just keeping me alive every day. And Heather, honey, you know, I just know that something's been coming along for you. Yeah. Well, thanks, Mom. I'm, I'm trying really hard. You know, I haven't always made the best choices. I, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm getting better, you know. And you know, they, they, you're my steel magnolia. And you're the strongest woman that I've ever known. Oh, honey. Well, I just do what I need to do to get by. You know, if God takes me right now, I know I've lived a good life, Heather Man. You know that I love you. I know, Mom. I know. And you know what, Mom? You uh, you're always right. Well, Heather Man. You know when life hands you lemons, you just make lemonade. Are your dreams in Requiem? Did you make the cut? 
I've bounced like Betty, I've taken it in the scream my head till it falls to the floor. Back room, baby, you're always the whore. So what are you gonna do now? Eliminate.